lucky to be alive after police say shots were fired at an Upper West Side apartment building. One of those bullets grazed a 17-year-old's head. As CBS 2's Naveen Dhaliwal reports, investigators are still searching for the shooter. As some enjoyed a calm, warm Saturday at the Douglas Houses on Columbus Avenue, the chatter was all about what happened the night before. It's awful because I sitting down in the, my sofa, I heard three shots. Police say gunfire erupted Friday after 10 p.m. So this should have Those shots startling neighbors. It was like, oh my gosh, who is that? This woman, who didn't want to be identified, called her friend. She's like, I need to get inside. Then she carefully glanced outside. I looked out the window. I saw the, the young woman. She was passed out on the ground. Witnesses say just moments before, a group of teenagers were gathered in the courtyard. Those teens got into an argument. That's when the gun went off. 50 cops came out of nowhere and then it turned into 100 cops. But there was relief as this witness saw the victim get up from the ground. They literally walked the girl with the bullet to the ambulance. A close call that is now creating anger. I want more security in this place. Carmen Quinones, the president of the Tenants Association, says youngsters are hanging in the lobbies and common areas in buildings. That was full the night before last with teenagers smoking and playing dice. NYCHA has to do its job and start that no lottery thing. One role to fight for, as many here just want their safety and peace. I feel uncomfortable because it's very dark. It's very dangerous too. Police say that teenage victim was taken to St. Luke's Hospital. She was last reported to be stable. As far as that shooter, detectives say, they're still searching for them. On the Upper West Side, Naveen Dhaliwal.